Uh, black. That's the package that you came in. African, Ethiopian. Okay, hi guys. Um, um, it's currently, I think around 11 o'clock and I'm getting ready to go to the airport. Um, I do have to take the bus to the airport, which kind of sucks um, because I don't have my family member dropping me, but everyone's at work and it's a Wednesday, January 15. So I'm just going to like bus it slash Uber it. But um, yeah, I'm really excited yet really nervous for this trip. But you know, I'm going to be gone for six months. So it's kind of like mind blowing. But yeah, I'm just kind of, you know, packing up, cleaning up. I still have, um, you know, some stuff to put away. Uh, I'll show you guys. Yeah, basically, um, this is my big suitcase. And I have a small carry-on and then a backpack that's going to fit all my school things. Um, not the greatest um, packer. Parker. Pack? Packer, yeah, that's what I'm trying to say. And you know, it's gonna be scary to see what the airport has to say, but you know, we move. <laughs> I'm just putting some last minute hair product away, and then um, I can be on my way to the airport. <laughs> okay, follow me on this journey. I'm so excited to share this with you guys, and let's go to Sweden. <laughs> Hi, guys, um, I'm in the airport, I'm in the washroom. <laughs> Finally checked in. I'm good to go. Just waiting on uh, my flight to uh, start loading us. Um, I think check-in or um, boarding is at 6:55. So yeah, I'm just kind of chilling, waiting here. Police for your case. I go to war for your case. I go to court for your case. I climb the bridge for your case. And I will die for your case. I punch the judge for your case. just got here like 30 minutes to an hour ago and oh my goodness it is 6 it's 6 30 right now and i got on the bus from stockholm sweden at 12 30 to get here for 4 55 5 o'clock so it was like a long commute and then now i'm in my airbnb for the night um still trying to figure out apartment situation and figure out what i'm gonna do Guys, let me just tell you that having so much bags to bring with you on a trip and not having Uber or anything to help you is hard work. Like, my body hurts and I don't know how I'm going to do this tomorrow because, uh, but anyways, yeah, I just wanted to show you guys my Airbnb. It's so cute. It's so nice. Too bad I'm only here for like one day. Um, then I have to move out again, but it's so cute. Let me show you around, okay? All right, so this is like a bed and another bed. So it's basically two bedrooms. This is my stuff. Sorry, I just, just came in and just took over. But it's so cute. This is a little space. Let me get it from this angle. Yeah, and there's a little dining table, and a little TV area. And then we go into this place. I don't know if... a little light for the kitchen area and there's a little fridge I think a little fridge and a little dishwasher I'm not sure it's so cute <laughs> yeah and this is just a little hallway so cute and this is me 
I don't think there's any uh, lights in this hallway. So, and then this is the little bathroom. Let me just turn on. So cute. <laughs> I'm gonna take a shower very soon because it's been a long day but yeah I just wanted to show you guys my little um, Airbnb it didn't cost me much it cost me in Canadian around $65 with tax included so it's all right but you know it's not sustainable if I was gonna book this three to four days so that's what I'm trying to figure out for the next day tomorrow where I can stay and how I can pay for uh, my student apartment or find somewhere I can just stay permanently and not have to pay like Airbnb or hostel fees yeah so thank you guys for watching this and I'll see you soon <laughs> uh, black that's the package that you came in African Ethiopian Nubian Melanin baby that's your brown skin